Hey, I'm David Bory. I'm a stand-up comic. Uh, and that dude's gonna get some pussy. Yeah, that guy is cool. On my way to your girl's house, like. He had a teardrop tattoo, too. Yeah, man, because he kills all the pussy. <laughs> Thrift shop. Me? Yeah. Uh, about f once, once every two weeks. About. Really? Sometimes more. Right now, I'm doing it a lot because you know. Because you got a TV show. Yeah, that's right. Because I got a big TV show. You got a here a lot? It's my first time. Oh really? Twenty nine years a month. Twenty nine years. Oh yeah. Wow. Yeah. Just, you know, anything you want to buy here, don't get excited like you want in your shoulder bag right there. Don't do that. Don't, <laughs> don't let the seller know you want that. Wow, look at these shoes, man. Those are really cool. I don't know that I'd have the balls to wear them, but also I made the I made the rookie mistake of saying they were cool. So I've tried to bang the gong for the fedoras, but the people who wear them just keep what, yeah. letting everybody down, dude. <laughs> like, there's a bunch of people who like, like if you could activate the fedora crowd, there's like a bunch of cool people who would be in it, but there is too a bunch of assholes, man. Yeah, it's just yeah, one of those things that the wrong crowd may claim to. I don't think that fundamentally there's anything wrong with those hats. No, of course not. I've been kind of getting in the habit of trying to buy like pins in one of these places. Rainbows. They're very hot because they've been out in the sun. They're hot? No, I mean they're physically hot because they've been sitting out in the sun. Oh man, but you could get a puff in them. I know, that's pretty cool, huh? <laughs> Show that to them. <laughs> well, uh, world's, world's greatest, greatest lover. lover. <laughs> that's really cool. Oh, this kid, you can put pills inside of? Little classic golf ball yeah, 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 yeah. It's a nice way to kind of make your drug habits seem a little more genteel. <laughs> Those look cool. They're full coverage. Oh man, I'm gonna buy these right now. Don't say it, you get it. My man. Thank you. Appreciate it. All right, man. Have a good one. You too. Bye. Hey, Phil. I feel like I could keep going, but the other thing is, is like the heat is killer. This really should be a winter episode. This is a bad one for August. I'm not, don't, inc don't include this part. Uh, can I get this James Brown top? Man. Oh, dude! <laughs> Isn't that dope? Oh, that's killer, man. Yeah, dude. Can you talk about what is beautiful about James Brown's mugshot? Uh, like why I like it? Yeah, yeah. I don't know, man. That dude's like perfectly flawed. Like he's like, you know, his life was really bad, but he was like the hardest working man in show business. Like pressure makes diamonds, right? Mm -hmm. That's true. I like, I like, I like that about him. I like that he was fucked up. I, it's easier to like look up to somebody who's kind of fucked up. Definitely want to come back here in the winter. Nah, just every weekend for the rest of my life, just become a shopaholic of other people's junk and beautiful mid-century furniture. I got these sunglasses, which I think they make me look like don't talk to him on the bus. Yeah. But also, he's got secrets. I think but I could kiss him. They're a little intimidating, but they've got definite style. Yeah, I feel good about them. I'm gonna wear them a lot, I think. And then you got some art, too. Oh, right? shit. This is the real come up of the day, in my opinion. Bam. James Brown's mugshot on a wood plank. David, thanks so much for doing the episode. Thanks for having me. You bet. Uh, here's your commemorative gift. It's a Las Vegas glass. Yes. It's got the name of current and extinct Las Vegas hotels on it. I'm gonna drink my liver extinct. Hell yeah, dude. Hell yeah, man. Thanks for doing the show. Let's do the light.